I had a friend that kind of had a thing for Mindy and called me up and said, do you think it'd be okay if I asked Mindy on a date today? And I said, you know what, that'd be fine, but she's got this guy and I think she's kind of into him, but knock your socks off. Mindy and Tom walk into the room, it wasn't three minutes before he came to me and he said, I don't have a chance. The first time anyone saw these two together, we all agreed. As the littlest sister, I've done a lot of observing Mindy's life over the years. You've taught me to follow Christ with all my heart, to love and serve other people well, to try my best no matter what challenge I'm facing, to enjoy life, and to look to God in a loving relationship with a fantastic man who I know will take care of you your whole life. By my side, you shine. Tom, you were you were the consummate older brother, you know, growing up, and I and I worshipped you. You know, we had so much fun hanging out. But I think the thing that I've learned the most from you uh, is perseverance and determination. And coming out here this weekend, I've had a lot of people ask me, you know, are you do you like the guy? Is she marrying a good guy? And I told them, my little sister, she loves your feedback. She loves taking it all in. She doesn't make bad choices. So when she picked Tom, and I've told people that from the start, she picked the right one. You know, you guys are an, an amazing couple, and I've watched you two, you know, have to have a long distance relationship over two years and the, the commitment and the and the trust and the dedication you've had for the relationship um, has been incredible and I remember asking Tom kind of when he came back from UVS it was that hard like a hard decision to make he said you know I didn't plan on it but when something is good and when something is right in your life you, you, you take a chance on it As long as we both shall live. As long as we both shall live. And with God's gracious help. This is my solemn vow. This is my solemn vow.